Margaret had always felt like she was playing catch-up with her taller friends. Her short stature made her feel like she was constantly being left behind, no matter how fast she ran or how hard she tried. She would watch as they effortlessly climbed trees and reached high shelves, their long legs and towering frames making them look like giants compared to her. But despite her envy, Margaret was a kind and curious child. She loved exploring the rolling hills and dense forests surrounding her village, always eager to discover new things and make new friends. One day, while wandering through the forest, she stumbled upon a hidden garden filled with the most magnificent flowers she had ever seen. The colors were so vibrant they seemed to glow in the sunlight, and the scents were intoxicating. As she explored the garden, Margaret noticed a strange stone statue of a woman with a kind face and long flowing hair. The statue was surrounded by a halo of light, and Margaret felt an odd sensation wash over her as she approached it. Suddenly, the statue began to speak to her in a soft, melodious voice. Welcome, little one. It said, I have been waiting for you. My name is Aira, and I am the guardian of this garden. I sense that you are feeling small and unsure of yourself. But do not worry, for I can help you grow. Margaret was amazed. She had never heard of a talking statue before, let alone one that could grant wishes. But as she looked into Aira's kind eyes, she felt a sense of trust and faith that she couldn't explain. I wish to be taller, Margaret said shyly, her heart's deepest desire pouring out of her in a rush of emotion. I want to be able to reach the high branches of the trees and see the world from a greater height. Ira nodded thoughtfully, her slender hand placing a gentle touch on Margaret's hip. The girl felt a surge of energy flow through her body, and suddenly she was growing taller by the second. Her legs lengthened, her spine straightened, and her head rose higher and higher until she was towering over her former self. As Margaret gazed upon her newfound height, she felt an immense sense of power and confidence. She knew that she could accomplish anything she set her mind to, and that the world was full of possibilities waiting to be explored. Ira smiled at her, proud of the growth she had fostered in Margaret's heart. Remember, little one, she said as Margaret prepared to leave the garden, true growth comes from within. You have always been told in spirit and heart. Now, go forth and share your light with the world. Margaret returned to her village a changed person, her newfound height and self-assurance, earning her the respect of her peers and the admiration of her parents. She no longer felt like she was playing catch-up with her taller friends, but rather that she was leading the way towards a brighter future. And though she never forgot the secret garden of growth, she knew that the true magic lay within herself all along. Years later, as a strong and confident young woman, Margaret returned to the forest and found Ira once again. She told the statue that her wish had come true, that she had grown taller and stronger than she ever thought possible. And she thanked Ira for showing her that true growth comes from within. Ira smiled and placed a slender hand on Margaret's head once more. I knew you would return one day, she said. You have always been a shining light, Margaret. Now, go forth and share your light with the world. And so Margaret did, spreading her wings and soaring into the unknown, ready to face any challenge that came her way. She knew that as long as she had Aira's guidance and her own inner strength, she could accomplish anything she set her mind to. And she lived happily ever after, her heart full of love and her spirit full of light. What did Margaret wish for when she spoke to Ira in the secret garden? Margaret wished to be taller so she could reach the high branches of the trees and see the world from a greater height. How did Ira help Margaret grow taller? Ira used her powers to grant Margaret's wish causing Margaret to grow taller by the second. What lesson did Margaret learn from her experience in the secret garden? Margaret learned that true growth comes from within, and that she had always been tall in spirit 
and heart. How did Margaret feel after she returned to her village as a taller, more confident person? Margaret felt proud and self-assured, knowing that she had grown taller, both physically and mentally. She no longer felt like she was playing catch-up with her taller friends. What message did Ira give to Margaret when she returned to the forest years later? Ira told Margaret that she had always been a shining light and encouraged her to continue sharing her light with the world.